Hello, Pisces. At the center of this reading is a tower moment. A tower moment is a sudden unexpected change that can rock your very foundation. Tower moments bring about the changes that we did not have the guts to make ourselves. Therefore, even though it's excruciating, it can also be liberating because it makes way for what is good for us, what's for our highest good. But some of you could have been waiting for something that was elusive, hard to grasp or maintain, or even impossible, though I don't believe anything's impossible. But some of you were stuck in this tower energy unable to move on from it. It could be about love, but it doesn't have to be. But this card talks about being open to proposals that could come your way. Do keep in mind, though, that not all proposals are romantic in nature. There are business proposals, or I could propose an idea, just as an example. If somebody is coming back, this is telling you to explore that proposal, but don't get blindsided by your infatuation with a person, place, or thing. Meaning, for instance, that X comes back and you're so excited that you ignore the red flags. Conversely, though, this could also talk about you. You could be getting blindsided by your own infatuation about how things should come about or play out. Maybe you're only accepting certain things in certain ways and not being flexible enough. It could go either way, truthfully. But you're feeling a loss of control. There could have been a difficult situation. But you're being guided to listen closely to what other people have to say. And potentially what they have to offer. There could be creative or financial opportunities hidden within these messages that you may not recognize if you're not paying attention. But also, too, you can learn the intent of a person when you listen more closely. There could have been unexpected obstacles. It could have left you feeling disoriented, confused. Maybe even a little bit of struggle or regret. 
could have gotten downhearted about a situation. Because of a tower moment. And that because of this tower moment, you feel like you lost control. For some of you, it could be because someone in authority made an offer that affected you in some way. For others, this is talking about after the tower moment, you're having to take leadership in your own life. To take risks. Because I'm getting the feeling here that that's what the energy is saying. You need to take risks. Maybe you're clinging on too tightly to the familiar. But the familiar apparently was not very healthy. Some of you could be wanting to reunite with someone. There could be a third party involved. There could be just the desire for harmony. Abundance, that type of thing. But with this card showing up after the tower, this tower leveled the playing field gave you back control. Whatever it is, this control has to do with the fact that now, after this tower moment, creative energy is emerging all around you. But some of you are still stuck in the tower energy, still feeling like you're chasing a pipe dream. Maybe some of you have not realized that you got your wish fulfillment. The obstacles that were standing in your way were removed. All the things that were keeping you from soaring high above the clouds, they're gone. This is a moment to be grateful for. You got some level of wish fulfillment. Maybe you're not recognizing it. But it's there. The energy is right to be successful. You've got the creativity. The obstacles were removed. Now it's about what are you going to do with it? Some of you are having to be very strong because this is an energetic transformation. You're transforming. The energy around you is transforming. And that can be a little bit disorienting in itself. So you may be juggling that unsure but what I'm getting most of all is that you're having a hard time being at ground zero this energy is all about maintaining a sense of adventure
feeling optimistic again, happy again. Actually delighting in being happy with the fact that anything can happen. Anything. So don't stay stuck in this tower energy. This tower was a gift. Not a curse. It only becomes a curse if you sit in it. Okay? So if this reading resonates with you, please give it a thumbs up. Feel free to share it. And if you're not already subscribed, please do. And I'll see you again soon. Bye.